Hello. It's good for us to have something to look forward to. For many, coming up to Christmas, this is a time when we get together with family and friends to celebrate the coming of our Saviour into this world. One of the predominant elements of this, traditionally, is to enjoy a feast on together on Christmas Day. Sadly, this year will not be quite as we would normally celebrate for most of us. However, what we can do is be encouraged at what God has planned through the passage today, Isaiah 25, verses 6 to 10. And what God has planned will not be disrupted by Covid or by anything else for that matter. This passage talks of a time when the Lord will prepare a feast for all peoples of rich food, the best meats and the finest wines. And the passage gives even more hope as the Lord will destroy the shroud that enfolds all peoples and nations. He will swallow up death forever. He will wipe away the tears from all faces and remove his people's disgrace from all the earth. These are such incredible words for us to hold on to, particularly in a time such as this. And we can hold on to the word of God and what he says to us will happen because he cannot lie. He is faithful and what he says is true. So I would encourage you to reflect on this passage today and be encouraged at what God has in store for us. In preparing for this thought for the day, I remembered a worship song that I haven't heard for a while. It's called His Banner Over Me by Kevin Prosh. And the first lines are, he brought me to his banqueting table and his banner over me is love. It can be found on YouTube if you'd like a listen. And may you know that you are God's beloved today. Amen.